guys, my name is Misha and I'm from the Faculty of Letters Suki. In this video, I want to introduce you and recommend you to recommend you to the game that I've been playing right now and that game is called Food Fantasy. Isn't that sound interesting? In this game, Food Fantasy is a game where you can manage a restaurant, adventuring and also collecting food souls or recipe in this game at the same time. So the reason why I want to recommend you this game is first, the first of the all, this game is free and you can just download it from the Play Store and the size is not actually that big unlike the other game that I played, their size is around 2GB or 3GB this game is only around 1GB and that is quite small for a game with many things packed inside it and also the update doesn't take too long like other game can take like one hour to update and this game just take around 10 minutes or 15 minutes so it can rest assured but you will need online connection too for playing this game the second thing the most beautiful thing that you can find in this game is the design of this game because like you know just look at all of this character though look like all of this the design is so good like the design is so good and it's actually a fantastic design and actually quite neat because because this design represents the food in a humanoid form and this is really neat because you can just know which one that you will like and you can find out which one of uh, it is your favorite food and what kind of form they will get in this game not only the humanoid form when we battle in this game we can also see them in a chibi version chibi means like that you know that small version where the head is big and the body is small and that that is really cute like they are so small and very very cute just i'll give you the example of this character it's they just like very small and adorable and doesn't look deadly at all even though their attack are really painful in the game then I will show you the screen of this game that, that have the character status and and with its skill screen so you can see how the game show you how the character looks together with its status and skill screen if you search for a certain food salt, you cannot get it from dungeon or other place. Most of them come from gacha, like you know that kind of summoning system where you need item to summon them, like yeah, gacha. You can get them from the gacha, but don't be sad if you doesn't get didn't get your character. You can still get them by collecting the shard, the food salt that you want. You can collect them one by one, either it's from shard fusion or from, you know, gather shard from the dungeon. The shard you need to gather are different from each rarity. Like for example, the air rarity only needs around 50 shards and the SSR rarity needs around 60 shards and the UR rarity needs 80 shards. And Good luck on collecting those shards. The third thing is, this game is very interesting to be played because you can send order, you can get order from NPC and you can send the order to get the reward from them. And it requires a real time, like one order can sums up around 10 minutes until 2 hours. It depends on which NPC and what kind of order they give. There's a food souls but at the same time they are food as well so other than gathering the food souls we can also we also have a restaurant where we can create our own recipe and like selling our food so in this restaurant you can just cook food and depending on the recipe there are four kind of recipe glory file recipe sakurajima recipe and the two others are Light Kingdom recipe and Lost Kitchen recipe. So each of these recipe have around 30 to more or less 30 recipe, 30 recipe in there. So good luck on figuring those recipe. 
If you are someone like me that have tried so many times but failed either way, like you tried five recipe and all of them end up failed because you failed to guess the recipe, you can just open the Wikipedia to see the list of the recipe and what kind of ingredients that you need. So long life, Wikipedia. Other than those three that I have told you right now, we also have a PvP system where we can fight other players to test our strength and also we have a system where we can join with our friend or random player to fight against a strong enemy to get a reward from them. The rewards are, the reward are quite good, you can get money on it or you can get the food shard that you cannot get anywhere aside from this stage so so how about it sound interesting right so i will be really glad if you end up playing this game or are even interested a little bit in the character or the this illustration so and by the way if you play this game tell me your id so we can chat in the game or play together okay thank you for watching bye bye